Hi Aquarius, welcome to your reading. Guys, we are doing messages from your person. Y'all know it's not an in-depth tarot reading. I use mainly the message decks to allow your person to do most of the talking. I will get started with a few oracle cards. Trying to help us understand what the energy is of the person coming forward for you. Let's jump in. Let's see whose energy is coming in the strongest for my Aquarius. Y'all know all my readings are meant to bring you confirmations of the things you already intuitively know about the person and the connection. If it doesn't happen with this reading, you can check out your other sign positions. I also do the extra wild card reading. That's like a collective reading. But you could check that one out and see if I was able to pick up the energy there this week. What am I sensing, guys? What am I hearing? Let's slow it down for a minute and let me formulate what this energy is bringing forward for me because I almost get the sense of somebody's in their head going what the what the ah confusion mm -hmm. it's, it's almost like this person has sore off love it's never going to happen yeah, I don't know if they were, you know, putting herself out there on, you know, in, in dating, open to dating and stuff. You know, that could be social medias, you know, those kind of dating platforms or what. This person is like, <laughs> they're like, oh, I can't date no more of that. But it's like they, they had given up. They, they had stepped into that full acceptance of the one for me is not out there. No. Yeah. And started redirecting their focus into other areas of their life. And then all of a sudden, what am I hearing? You appear. It's almost like they're, they're questioning the divine. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it, it, they feel like they were meant, you were brought to them for a reason, and, and I don't think the person grasped but that. The way they were searching, searching, searching for the one, they had to go through the rigors of that frustration because they weren't getting it from their guides of, you know, that's not how we're bringing it to you. They're going to show up in a different way. But this person kept on and on and on. Going through a lot of rejection. And a lot of, you know, rejection on their side. And rejection from others. Until they were burnt. And gave up. And like, okay. It's not going to happen. And then you show up. So there's a sense of the divine has brought you into their life. But they are like, what? Why now? Why now? Oh. Let's pick their energy up, guys. Let's see the energy on this. This is for my Aquarius. Ooh. Ooh, right here. Ow! Finding the missing pieces of their self. <laughs> yeah. But getting clarity about their self and what they've been doing. Mm -hmm. How they've been trying to force... Universe, I want the person that's meant for me. But bring it through the balloon. It's so only the bling. I only accept it if that person, my person, comes through the bling. They arrive through a hot air balloon. Universe says, no, they, they're going to they're gonna arrive in a different way. And you got to give up the, I, I need them to show up in a balloon. That's the only way I'm going to know. Uh, you showed up a different way for them. Oh, but they got, they did lose sight of their self for a little bit. Let's see what else, because that finding missing, the missing, what I thought was missing, you showed up. You're like that missing piece. Oh, gosh, yes. Ooh, bam, boom. 26. Eighth house energy, filling the partnership, filling the I want to be joined with you. Yes. I want to build with you. You're the one. Let's start new. Step into the newness of this. But guys, the number 26 is taking us through the house of what? Second house, stability, cash, property, learning how to share because eighth house is sharing energy. And also the sixth house energy of balance and acclimating change. Yes. Ooh, interesting. Hold the energy on the deck. 
But over here we've got what four and six ten tenth house energy. Ooh, some of us might have met uh, through career or work, something creative that would have to do with what you know career or work. And in and to this person it would be in an unexpected way. They didn't think that you were going to show up in that in that you know they were looking elsewhere like out in their social life away from career and that focus so yeah oh okay let's get the energies on both sides use your intuition because i am trying to pull in your person's energy and get their perspective so you have to use your intuition to know which one of these energies is the way they're seeing you first person's energy bring that into us huh? How, oh, main woman, nobody has my attention. You're the one that I want. Oh. Love story. A true love story never ends. Let's start a new chapter. Oh, new chapter over here. That's what this, this one is. That's the reason we've got two books. One's at the beginning and one's at the end of, um, it's either a new chapter or a whole new beginning for this person. Let's do second person's energy here. Pick up the second person. Pop. Separation. I had to walk away to find what I deserve. Had to walk away. Ooh, so this person may have walked away from a connection. Their self, they may be in separation. Yeah, they did. They're in the point of liberation. Mm -hmm. I'm setting myself free and embracing new experiences. So this person over here has also been through a little bit of a battle. We've run into each other, and that may be the, why we have this, because this person is freeing their self from their own dogma <laughs> of giving into and giving up. Literally have given up hope of, there's no one out there for me. If I have a twin flame, they're not on this timeline with me. <laughs> no. They way out in the future where I'm going to die old and lonely in this lifetime and never get to experience being with them. Or they're from the past. And unless we get a time machine, I'm screwed. This person gave up completely. This person is stepping into um, deliberation of their self of what do I deserve. They're coming out of something that, you know, wasn't good for them, for them on a personal level. Going through that healing process. Huh, hold the energy. Let's get them talking. Let's see what deck they would like to start talking with. We getting the roses. The light side of the rose deck. Oh, I like that one. This is for my Aquarius, their person. Let's set the energy up on this deck, please. For my Aquarius, this person. We've already got one for us. Set the energy. I want to be the one that gives you everything you need. Ow, right off the bat. Yes, let me be the one for you. I wish things were simpler. I feel like I have been missing you my whole life. You're incredibly sexy. Nothing compares to you. Mm-mm. I don't want to be the one you run to. Let me be the one for you because I'm feeling a divine plan on you're the one for me. I don't mean to be so selfish. I can't stand not being there with you. Oh, well, yeah, guys. I was not looking for something like this. I had given up complete hope. Why now? Universe brings you in now. Maybe they just need to let go of the what the with the universe and just go, thank you. Oh my God, thank you. I wish you could see how beautiful and amazing you truly are. The moment I saw you, I knew I was going to fall in love with you. I knew. I knew, I knew, I knew. You're all I've ever wanted. I'm not sure how you really feel about me. Keep talking. Anything else? Yes, there's more. Give me a chance. There is nothing I wouldn't do for you. 
There is so much I want to say to you, but I always back out. Oh, this person, I get a sense they feel like they're, they come, they might worry that you think they're coming on too fast. You're what has been missing in my life. You're my paradise in heaven. My love for you will never die. I'm burning with passion and desire for you. I'm worried that you are losing interest or that you're not interested. I just want to see you smiling with true happiness. True happiness. No fake smiles, y'all. Please try to understand how I feel. Mm -hmm. I hope you feel the same as I do. Please be patient with me. I wasn't expecting to fall so in love with you. Hold the energy on the deck. Let's see where they're going next. This is for my Aquarius. Which deck? Oh, it's behind me. You got it. Got Victoria's Love Oracles. Guys, let's get the energy up on this deck. It's for my Aquarius, their person. It's for my Aquarius. Set the energy for me, please. There we go. Talk to us. Mm, pop. I'm in love with you. I'm talking about you to others just so you will know your topic of my conversation. If you let me, I'll take care of you. Your kindness has changed my life. I'm playing games on purpose. I can't get over you. Anything else? Yeah, we're getting more. I feel stuck. My intentions can be selfish at times. I realize that. I keep writing and deleting messages. I'm trying to distract myself from my feelings. It's not working. Mm, not working at all. I find you interesting. Unbelievably interesting. I want you, but I shouldn't. What else? What else? What else? Pop. I think you're hot. I'm very attracted to you. Reach out to me, please. I want to be like you. Mm. I'm planning on messaging you soon. And my intentions are pure. Yes, they are. And I will tell you up front, truthfully, when I'm being selfish. Mm. Hold the energy on the deck. Aquarius, let's go ahead and get your person to focus their energy onto the deck. They want to give you a final and closing message from. Let's see what they want to bring out here. Talk to us. Talk to us. You got it. Yeah, we're getting showered with some love. Light side of a uh, conversation with counterpart. It's my Aquarius, this person, Aquarius. Energy for me. Right here. Final message. Final message. Pop. Please love me as I am. You're my greatest adventure. I'll cross oceans for you. In a season reason or lifetime of love you're my eternity you matter to me you do matter to me your opinion your feelings your thoughts they matter i can't remember my life before this love 
And last one, guys. I wished for you for so long, and I had gave up hope. And bam, here you are. Aquarius, guys, that's all I have for us. Sending you love and light. Bless me.